and welcome back to the program. I am once again your host, Joe. Uh, today we're going to continue with more Chrono Trigger. Well, last we left off, uh, I beat these dinosaurs over here, and then a save point appeared, and I said to myself, right before I went to use the save point, I used a bunch of ethers to restore a bunch of my characters to magic. And I was like, I swear to God, if I beat these enemies and a save point appears, I will be annoyed. And then, lo and behold, literally what happened? The Raptites have stolen my gay key, I need it back. What's this? Could those apes have made something this advanced? Azala. Ah, the apes have arrived. Hm. You're nothing like Isla. Tell me what this is at once. Tell Azala about the key? No. I guess you need some motivation. Come, Nisbel! Queen of the dinosaurs right there. Why is he so beefy? Alright, well, uh... When, when, when lightning, all dinosaur injured. Or whatever the word, whatever they said. One fifty-eight off the rocket punch. Let's uh he's not in range of the max cyclone. Let's hit him with the kick. And I'll I'll test Robo's just melee attack. Oh, uh, four sixty-five, that's respectable. Yeah, okay, here's my strategy. Releases electrocution energy. Oh! Okay, that was a big hit. Uh, uh, I, um, uh, uh, um. There, be, uh, be stunned again, would you? He did it again. He did it again. Uh, physician, feel th heal thyself. Uh, Robo, you took the biggest hit off of that. No damage. Spiffy. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. I can, I can hit him with the lightning, his defense power will decrease, yeah, and then Chrono and Isla should get their attacks off at the same time, at which point I can use the drill kick. And the rocket punch, why not? Double team him. You will note, this is the first boss I've fought since Massa and Mune combined. He's close enough. He is close enough. Isla will heal Robo. Robo will heal Chrono. Isla will then heal herself. And Robo will make with the Max Cyclone. I could have waited. Whatever, it's fine. Get him! Yep, you know, I figured that would do more, more, more damage. Uh, hey, 
Robo, you are in the worst shape. Just absolutely doing terrible. Okay. Oh, that's... Eh. I've had worse. Alright, defense power down went shocked. Another max cyclone. And a rollo kick, why not? No, he got the thing off. God damn it. That's not going to do anything. This guy's beefy. Uh, what does the does the power meal? I can't use the power meal in combat. Yeah, why not? Chrono, use an item. Sure. We'll we'll use a kiss on 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 Chrono to get some health back. Uh, am I gonna have enough MP to use? I'm gonna have just enough MP to use another Max Cyclone. It does a lot of damage. Yeah. Okay. Ten whole tech points. Okay. The ape's beaten his bell. Give thing back to Chrono. Now. Uh, but remember, we reptites will rule the world. Take it. Your days are numbered. I do not detect any damage. Beep boop. I fight any time, Azala. I'll no lose. Burp. Fast travel back to the camp. You leave, Chrono? You no fun for Isla. I'll never forget you, thanks. Sorry, Chrono. I try to be strong now, just like Chrono. Come again, Chrono. Party, eat, dance, fight, fun. Sorry, Chrono. Yeah, yeah. Alright. So not only do we have our red rock, we also have uh, our... Well, we got our red rock. We got our gate key back, we got our red rock. That's the important thing. Uh, which of these huts has uh, Sweetwater Lady? Yeah, I did not get any of my magic points back. Uh... Oh, look at that. Uh, let's offer Petal and Fang for Ruby Gun. Sure. You, tell me about the items. Ruby Gun, Sage Bow, Petal and Feather for Stone Arm. Okay, Petal, I don't have enough feathers. Okay, Petal and Horn for Sage Bow. Fang and Horn for Flint Edge. Okay. Fang and horn. Mm, 
Respectable difference. Dear God. Uh, can I get the sage bow? Pedal and horn for sage bow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nope. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm sure I'll find something good shortly. Uh, are you the sweet water lady? Yeah. Give me that. Okay, now we just need to escape back to my own time. We're done in the past. And unfortunately, we have to leave our hot cave babe behind. Oh no. Yeah, uh, Akira Toriyama's designs in this go hard, and uh, Ayla is just like, wow, okay. She is a fan favorite for a reason, let me tell you. Alright, the laser rave killed off the dinosaurs. Just have these two guys up here now. Yeah, she hits like a truck. She has a ton of health. Uh, and and she's she's a, a buff boss lady. She is like a Toriyama muscle gal, you know? Normally Toriyama doesn't give ladies muscles. But like, Isla gets them. Or a beam. Or a beam? Could I have had a group heal this whole time other than uh alright, I gotta I gotta try to save. Heals everybody. That's pretty good. Okay. does make me wonder if perhaps there's a dual tech that I could have with, uh, with, with Luca as well. <laughs> Max Cyclone is so good and also so just silly. It's just Robo grabs Chrono by the ankles and spins him. It does so much damage, but it's so good. Eight tech points, one horn. If I get a feather before I make it back to the portal, then maybe I'll turn around, but that doesn't seem to be happening. Alright, into the gate we go! Yes, jump in. Alright. Uh, Luca! The Massa Moon! You found a Dreamstone. I'd forgotten how beautiful they are. You'll need to find someone that can process that mineral. You'll probably find him in Medina, a village near the, the Mystic Mountains. I feel like that's close enough. Off we go! Hopefully that red rock wasn't important to history, because I just grabbed it and took it to the future. Uh, we did not think about this at all. I could have changed everything. You found some Dreamstone, then I'll repair the Massa Moon. How on earth did you get the Massa Moon? And the Dreamstone? No, don't tell me, I don't think my heart could take it. It'll take a little while to fix this. I'll lend a hand. Beep boop. 
Not only do you have the moon, you also seem to have a, some sort of robot following you around. That's weird. All right then. How are you gonna fix it? To repair the Master Moon, we must process the Dreamstone and activate the sword. You work on the Dreamstone and I'll work on the sword. Okay, leave it to Luca the Great. Nobody calls you that, Luca. At any rate, leave this to me. Gonna be mighty busy. I'll stand here and shake my head then. To energize this sword, we must first rejuvenate that broken the broken sword. This is pretty complicated. You're breaking my concentration, so fuck off. But you find somewhere else to go for a while. Alright, it's done. Now bring me the Dreamstone. I'm done here too. At any rate, leave this to me. Alright, let's get started. Okay, so here's what we need to do. Uh, I'll put the two pieces of sword together, you bring a rock over, and then we'll both start chanting. Sorry to keep you waiting. We needed the lighting to be proper for this reveal. It's a sword as big as Luca is. Take a good look, this is the Masha Moon. How strange, my senses are picking up. Spiritual energy emanating from the Masha Moon. Well, I think that's everything. Chrono, let us take the Massa Moon to Frog. Wait. This weapon represents considerable power. Your actions may either save or destroy life. Wield your sword with full knowledge of the consequences. Would you like to buy something? He's just like, you have in your hands a powerful weapon, which with it you can control the balance of life and death. It's a great power I've bestowed upon you, and you must be judicious with it in its application. Will that be cash or credit? Do you need a purchase for do you need a bag for your purchases? Yeah, Truce Canyon, here we go. We guts to go give the Massa Moon to Frog. Look, I like the team of Chrono, Marl, and Luca. I also like the team of Chrono, F Robo, and Frog. And also Chrono, Robo, and Isla. And basically, uh, this is the problem with this game, is I want to play with everybody. Fire Punch. Yep, okay. They did have a dual tech waiting in the wings. It's pretty obvious what it's going to look like, but let's do it anyway. That. All right, fire punch. Oh, nice. Okay. Definitely looks cool. We appreciate a cool looking spell. I suppose it, hmm, can I, can I find, is Toma still at the inn? Can I go chat with Toma? He was never at the inn, he's at the cafe. Market, cafe. Yeah, he's still here. Hey, you again, how about buying me a soda? Thanks, I'll wish you a safe journey. Oh yeah, okay, I don't know which island the money gave me is gone, what should I do? I, mean, I could spot him some cash. I don't know what he's after, but you know, I can give him some cash. It's not like I'm strapped for it or anything. Save. <gasps> oh, 
A new! Stop it, you dog! And the important thing is, we did get the new on screen. He is not dead. I repeat, the new is still alive. Somehow. He'll kill that frog. No, he'll just hit it a little bit. Huh. Okay. Not what I expected. Oh, no, 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 there he goes. No, that's Chrono dead. Okay, let's uh, revive. And you can cure beam yourself real quick, just because I know what's going to happen. Yeah, 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 that's fine. That's fine. There! The new is taken care of. Holy shit, I forgot the new did that. Uh, just the headbutt that takes you down to one health. Uh, serious business move. I mean, Chrono fucking died. He's back up now. Thank god I bought revives. 34 tech points. Robo tackle. Exactly what we needed. Uh, Tis thee again. Th this sword. Tis the Massa Moon. I must ponder this turn of events. Uh, remaineth here the night. Remaineth. Cyrus, are you leaving? Yes, it's time we took back the medal from the Frog King. And I'd like to see that mythical sword for myself. But Cyrus, the kingdom needs you. And Lini and I need you. You must return to us. As long as there's life in these bones, I shall return. By your leave. Sir Cyrus! We, the Knights of the Square Table, wish you a safe journey. Listen well, my friends. I now entrust the safety of the kingdom to you. Pardon the delay, shall we be off? Glenn, you be careful, too. Be of sound health, your majesty. Ah, uh, yes, Sir Cyrus and uh, th that fella. God, the foreshadowing. So, you want the badge of courage, dear knight of the kingdom? Well, come and take it if you can. Grib it! Prepare yourself, Polywog. On guard. Nirvana strike. Ugh, how dare you pick on a hapless amphibian? Filthy metal, I won't forget this. How do you like the taste of my blade? It tastes like teen spirit. Ah! Beware, Glenn! Cyrus the Sword! The Massa Moon! Yeah! Is that the best you can do? Without your sword, you're nothing! Ah! Uh, you haven't beaten me yet! S Cyrus, I'm a, I'm a goner! Glenn, escape while I keep them at bay! But, but 
If you stay, they'll get us both. Go on, Glenn. You'd better worry more about yourself, Cyrus. Come on, Glenn, go! Yeah! S Cyrus? R run, Glenn! The Queen, take care of... Lean! Cyrus? Cyrus! I did not put any forethought into what I was doing from, from Magus' voice. Huh. What's the matter? Aren't you going to try your luck? Uh... Yeah, cat got your tongue, kid. How about it, Magus? Can't you give him a more fitting form? Alright, why not? There's always time for a little fun. Yeah, you spineless wimp. Oh. A robo goes to sleep, and Luca just curls up on him. That's cute. Chrono sleeps in dirt. Uh, <laughs> if Marl is here, I think she sleeps in a chair, which is sensible. Ten years hath passed. Can I do it? I've changed so much. Alas, poor Cyrus. This sword's much bigger. It's twice the size of my body. It's ridiculous. Awaketh, Chrono. Awaketh. Oh my god. Though we may fail, let us go to Magus' lair. Thou knowest his power? Nothing can beat science. We also have magic. Beep boop. We must do it to save our future. Alright. Oh. He can't put it on yet. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, I also need to take him to the end of time so he can talk to Specchio. The Master of War. I think I still have the option of going to the bridge and then just running across. Uh, you know, I don't need to. I don't need to look at the. I can. I can. Yeah, no. I can. I can refill my health and stuff at the end of time. There's a magic bucket for that and everything. No. Still badass. Learn dual tech blade toss and triple tech triple raid. This is exactly why I like the team of Robo, Frog, and Chrono. Is because they get the first triple tech really early, relatively speaking. All right, hit points of magic restored. Save point arrived at. Let's go bring our friend to Specchio. No. What a weird fellow. Uh, God, what voice did I give him? Um. Uh, all right. What a weird fella. Being a frog, let's give him water. Ipso facto minimo magico. Robo can't use magic. Frog learned to use magic. So, fortified with magic, want to try it out? No. You guys are too much. Bring newcomers to meet me. He's still in his weakest form. I would gain nothing from this. Oh, 
What a strange new guest! Are you from the Middle Ages? Yes. Frog-like. Middle Ages. What dost thou mean? Middle. Middle compared to what? What am I saying? They wouldn't know which words to use. They'd say middle compared to whence. Whence is absolutely not the right word to use, which is why they would use it. Bubble Snap Sword Stream. Hmm. Still learning new moves. Right, because now he has magic. And he will learn a heal in 158. And you will learn a heal in 338. You will learn Lightning 2 uh, in a while. Uh, hmm. I wonder if the markets down here sell anything that I might find of value. No, no, okay. I figured very slim odds that they would just straight up sell robot arms, but you never know. Yeah, this is what they talked about. This is the magic cave. Cyrus, run for your lives! Alright, stop spinning. Thanks, Cyrus. <laughs> Glenn, there's times when people simply have to grit their teeth. But, but it hurts when I get hit. They... You're a marshmallow, Glenn. They made a custom sprite just for just for Cyrus looking off the bridge. And then Glenn gets the fucking townsman sprite. Hey Glenn, I've been thinking about becoming a knight. I knew you were going to enlist. You'll make a great warrior. Why don't you join too? I don't think I'd make the cut. But why? You're better with a sword than I am. I don't know. I think I'd really lose it if I had to hurt someone. Zap! Did I leave a chest behind? Hard to say. Robo's still using a very primitive weapon, comparatively. The, the metal! The hero's metal! Are you gonna say handeth? Handeth over the Massa Moon. Or stick it in the ground. One of those two, for sure. My name is Glenn, Cyrus's hopes and dreams, and now the Massa Moon. Forthwith I shall slay Magus and restore honor.
Kablam! All right, pretty badass. Hey, Frog, how many more of those laser beam swords have you got in you? Uh, just the one. We'll never see him do anything that cool with the sword again. And look, they all equipped it on him. So now I give him the hero medal. I also save there and say, that's a good place to leave off for now. Thank you for tuning in. I have once again been your host, Joe, and I will see you next time with more Chrono Trigger.